Hi, this video tutorial I will cover how to create, how to initialize and how to access an array. Using new operator, we can create an array. And here I have declared uh, int array. Size of the int array is 5, meaning uh, it can store only 5 elements. And uh, here you can see how to initialize uh, first element, how to initialize uh, second element and uh, so on. And using numerical index, we can access the array element. And here you can see how to access the array element. We will see one example now. Here I have declared the class uh, array demo one This class has uh, main method. First I will run this program, then I will explain. This is the output of uh, this sample program. Inside main method, I have created uh, int array. Size of the int array is uh, 5 and uh, here I am initializing uh, first element, here I am initializing uh, second element and uh, so on. And using for each loop, I am getting uh, each element from uh, int array and uh, displaying the elements. And uh, here you can see the output. This is uh, another way of creating an array and uh, here uh, length of the array is uh, determined by the number of values uh, provided between these uh, braces. We will see one example now. Here I have declared uh, array demo 2 class. It has a main method. First I will run this program, then I will explain. This is the output of uh, this sample program. Inside main method, I have uh, created a int array and it has uh, 10 elements. And using for each loop, I am getting uh, each element from int array and uh, displaying uh, each element. And uh, here you can see the output. And uh, this is about uh, how to create, how to initialize and how to access the array. And uh, thanks for watching.